Okay, here you've got one of the few meaningful runs Cincinnati pulled off through the day, uh, at least from you know a, a called run or a or a designed run. Um, so, it, it, like I said, we're going to go here. He's going to go kind of off the guard here. Um, just watch. So this one seems pretty simple based on what I've seen. So you've got Stutzman coming on that, that a gap blitz that, I mean, <laughs> this, this team loves to blitz its linebackers right up the a gaps. Um, but I don't know what I can't tell. We'll get back to the snap itself. So just before the snap Stutzman comes down and gets over the center. Um, I can't tell based on what happens the second the ball is snapped if Kanick is supposed to loop around. If, if Stutzman's going to go across the center's face, let's see what he does. No, I mean, he's – that doesn't look like that's what he was doing there. I mean, obviously, Cincinnati's down blocking, but still, I, I don't think that was – it doesn't look like he's working hard to get across the center's face there. Um and then have Canik blitz on the, you know, on the what would be the center's left side, but obviously everything gets confused. Canik's probably a beat late in recognizing the down blocks, and so he immediately starts trying to work his way back across. But Stutzman, who's taken on a guard, he gets caught. Canik gets sealed by the center. So I, some of it's bad, just bad luck. Uh, but the other is, it, I mean, Canik either is coming on a blitz where it is bad luck or he reads this wrong, takes a step up and gets trapped inside. That, that's the, the latter is my guess, just based on what I'm looking at, what I'm seeing. Um, so I think, I think that's what happened, but, um, you know, just, Something to something to look at. And like I said, still think Jaron Canick played a really good game. Nearly had a sack a few snaps before this. So uh, just just one of those moments, you know, you're going to have with a rookie Mike. There, there's a lot to learn.